hello trader welcome once again to uh, one more video session where uh, we will show the uh, complete analysis of the trade uh, one of the client uh, had made a loss in their account so he shared the investor id and password so this is the account live uh, as you can see and uh, the client has traded in xau usd and xag usd gold and silver now this is the complete analysis we have done here as you can see on the screen uh, this is the lot size uh, and the positions that he had used to trade all the open trades uh, we have analyzed you can see the gold lot size 0.53 xag uh, usd lot size 0.9 in sale now in buy uh, they have total 0.74 lots and 1.03 in silver in buy so this is the complete analysis uh, of the trade now below you can see uh, once we change the once we change uh, you can see the 9000 usd running loss and this is the total of all these two uh, all these two uh, all, all two pairs now gold and silver this is the current price which you can see on the screen right side 26.86 and 1930 you can verify the detail so we will change the gold price to 2150 which is the current uh, which is the expected price and the profit you can see here 4461 negative and 26.86 if we change to 35 his account will come into profit so that means when the gold reaches to 21.50 and xag usd reaches to 35 his account will come into profit 829 us dollar you can see on the screen so this is the potential uh, this is the possibility of the account coming to profit when these two instruments price reaches at certain point but the chances are very less because the hedging is not done as per the you know uh, as per as per the uh, from the proper levels client has not used proper level and risk and reward because uh, you can see the break even point at 2150 and 35 and it can take up to 3 to 6 months to reach to that point so now we will open the uh, so now we will open the client's uh, statement right now we are showing you that how you know uh, what are the possibilities that client can make the profit or at what point his account will come at break even point no profit no loss so now we will come to the uh, statement part so in this account you can see the deposit 18266 the complete trading history from top to bottom it's been only 7 trading days only 7 trading days since uh, you know client deposited the money and you know started trading so his number of profits uh, are really great almost 83 84% percentage so you can verify this is the same account 1 2 4 2 minus negative minus 1242.60 cent so you can check the trading history so the trading history that we are showing you it matches with the account that we are showing live so this is the both same there is uh, there is nothing uh, different or nothing otherwise
so now we will check uh, we will analyze the trading history let me just reset the screen so that you can see it conveniently 1242 US dollar in loss and complete complete transparency so now we will resize the screen so that you can see so the floating floating pl is 7961 something which you can uh, verify with the live trades so this is just to you know uh, to let you know that uh, there are no two accounts just one account the clients real account and uh, now this is the uh, you know position window where you can see the deposit deposit made is 28,666.28 net profit is minus 1,242 so we will resize this we will adjust the screen and we will do the analysis okay so we are all set now so the average profit of the client is 115 average loss 700 and 80 and uh, profit rates 47 loss rates 9 so accuracy is 84 percent as we just mentioned now the average profit is 115 and the average loss rate is 789 but you can check the clients number of trades in profit 83 out of 100 only 16 percent uh, trades are in loss so the average is really 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 good which is really plausible then why client made a loss why so that's the question the question to this answer lies in the risk reward pattern so how to bring a risk reward clients risk reward pattern so what we will do we will divide average trade profit by average trade loss so 150 divided by uh, 789 so the answer is 0 0.14 so this is the average uh, 0 0.14 so now if client traded 47 trades with 150 uh, you know profit then his profit would be as you can see on the screen 7050 us dollar you please understand we are taking this uh, 47 from this total profit trades so client has done total 47 profit trades and nine loss trades so if you have 150 uh, you know per, with per uh, with single trade if he earns 150 dollar then his total profit would be 750 now if he maintains the loss if he maintains the loss then 400 loss per trade so if he maintains this 400 us dollar loss in each trade then his nine trade would make 3600 us dollar loss and after you know closing this 3600 us dollar loss his account would still be in profit of 3450 us dollar which you can see on the screen 
so here what client did client waited for 789 us dollar loss where he could not maintain the risk pattern so client has to maintain the uh, you know uh, the risk pattern he must close at uh, 400 us dollar then he would have closed his account at 3450 us dollar profit which you can see on the screen 7050 profit minus 3600 loss is equal to 3450 us dollar net profit if client would have followed our pattern 1s to 1 or 1s to 5 at at best you know our standard uh, risk reward pattern is 1s to 1 1s to 2 at the best 1s to 5 so his uh, you know uh, gross profit here gross loss would be 3600 his gross profit would be 7050 so net profit if he would have followed then his profit net profit could be 3450 with the you know 150 400 risk reward pattern so if you divide 150 by 400 then profit risk reward ratio would come 0 0.37 if you divide 150 by 400 it would come 0 0.37 whereas client actual risk reward was 115 divided by 789 is equal to 0 0.14 so this was the uh, you know clients actual uh, risk reward pattern but he sh should have followed 0 0.37 risk reward pattern then his account would have would be in profit so now if you have any questions query uh, you can always ask us uh, contact in the link given below so we advise to follow strict risk reward pattern always 1s to 1 maintain 1s to 1 minimum to 1s to 5 best so share your uh, you know uh, account and we will analyze just like this thank you for being with us thank you